for asparagus soup. We're gonna cook the asparagus. Now, what happens is in an asparagus, the most tender the, and the most juicy part is the head, which is about from the top till about three inches. So, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take a few of these asparagus heads mm -hmm. and just cut them and keep them aside. All right. So, we're gonna just probably blanch them and then we're just gonna add them as garnish or just as All topping right. to the soup. So, these are right. important. So now we'll yeah. move on with the onions. So. Yeah. Wow. You know, more than cooking, I enjoy chopping actually. I'm going to chop it. It's fun, right? It's a stress bus. Stress, frustration, you just come back home and peel and chop onions, you know. Now, some garlic. What some ginger. Yeah. Okay, we've got the pan hot. Now, I'm gonna just add some butter and I'm just gonna add a little bit of oil as well because butter, kya hota hai? it starts to burn, burn faster. Burn, right? Yeah. yeah, okay. So, uh, some peppercorns. Black peppercorn, black gold. Just a couple. Uh, Tejpatta, which is bay leaf. Just one. Now, I'm gonna add some mustard. Mustard. Some green chilli. Is it a You like hot? Karara? Yes, yes. I think one should be okay. Or okay, maybe more. You said yes, yes twice. Yeah, yeah. I like spicy I'm, food. I'm assuming you like spicy. Yeah. Now I'm gonna add some curry patta. It's gonna be yummy. Like really strong flavor is gonna come out. <laughs> now we're gonna add. The green chili, garlic, ginger, onion, all, all in together. one. Hilate ro. Wow. Wow. Red pepper, bajate ro. Yahan ke hilate ro ho raha hai. this is just freaky. All right. So we don't have to brown them. Okay. Just a little bit sweating the onion, so it's <laughs> sweated properly. All right. Now I'm gonna add asparagus, just roughly chopped, because this will be pureed anyway. Okay. Now we're gonna add a nice heap spoonful of maida. Okay. And just cook the maida now. Oh my god, all right. So, yeah, just, just. Okay. So the, yeah. It's like, and just, mein mammi na just, 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 that water. You that, want water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Add just add water. It'll go brown. Keep now. Just keep adding. Keep adding. Yeah. Just one very quick boil, and uh -huh. we take it off because we okay. don't want to discolor the asparagus. But before oh. we do that, it looks very pretty right now, by the way. We've got these spinach leaves, which have been blanched. Up is spinach ko hum tayar rakhenge. Now you see the boil. Yes, I can see them splutter and yeah. the bubbles come. Yeah, it's just starting. So just one quick okay. rumble boil. And so it's important for the maida to get cooked, right? Otherwise, it's not a cheap flavor either. Yeah, so maida got. for the maida? No, maida got blonde. Okay. Now that we had added water, uh -huh. water just kind of binds everything together. together. So it just gets one boil there. And you take it off the flame quickly. Right. So I'll get a blender. We just need to blend this. All right. Yeah. Okay, so. Got some ice cubes. I like the sound ice mix, you know, cut, 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 Drinks ki aada hai. Yeah. <laughs> like cold coffee I made, hello. Yeah, of course. <laughs> now. Okay, that was quick. I'm going to add some blanched spinach to it. Now, what blanched spinach does, one, bit of nutrition. Second, gives it a very good green color. Wow. So, we've got the blended soup. Now you have a choice. You can either strain it mm -hmm. and get a very clear soup, or you can have it a bit grainy. Which one you prefer? Uh, I'll take the healthy version of it. I don't straining. know what, what. No, no, I'll, I'll strain. You'll strain. <laughs> 
So okay. So you like it to be without any, uh, you know. What do we have to say? I have to say the, just the opposite. No. Now hold this. So you have to say do the, just the opposite of what I have to say. Yes. All right. So you just take a kerchief and just gently see below. All right. So. Okay. We've got most of it out. All right. I'll just put a cup here. I'm just gonna get rid of this. You can put that pan back. Just gonna give it a quick boil. All right. So, exactly when do we put the coconut in this? Just okay. towards the finishing. So, thick coconut oh. milk, or if you're any time adding any cream, always towards the last. You don't right. overcook something which is very very fatty usually. All right. It's boiling now, so that's it. And we just turn it low. We'll add right. some salt. Now we need some coconut milk. Now coconut milk will just bring down all the uh, sharp flavors in the soup from okay. garlic, onions, okay, and mustard. Okay. Just just make it very very homogenized and very very subtle. Just a little, not too much. Again, one quick boil, and you can okay. what you can do is add. Let's say half a twist of lime. Just a twist of lime. All right. And that's it. I'm just going to add the asparagus heads into the soup. All right. You can blanch them and add. And then add. But because I think the soup is hot already, so I don't think it's just yeah. going to cook in. Yeah, that's that's nice. Now I'm just going to pour in the soup. Just look at those colors now. Asparagus and coconut soup. And it looks yummy and healthy. And I've already had my share. Do you want to try this? Or no, can I if, do the honor? No, no, no. Is this pretty? It's very pretty. Then it ends up on my yellow table and we'll have it together ah, with right, the rest right. of the food. All right, all right, all right. All right.